And because of those warnings, many people are opting to stay home instead of traveling for Thanksgiving, but millions of others will be hitting the road. News Channel 5's Eric Hilt has more on what you should do to keep yourself safe if you're traveling over the holidays. About 50 million people were planning on traveling for Thanksgiving. Just south of the Tennessee state line. It's been nice, uh, quiet, empty. Things looked much different than you'd expect just days before Thanksgiving. Because the road is quieter, the highway is quieter, not as much traffic, and a lot of people are staying home. That's because doctors are urging people not to travel for Thanksgiving. We're not stopping anywhere except we're driving. As COVID numbers spike in Tennessee and across the country. Thanksgiving travel will look different this year. AAA spokesperson Megan Cooper says for the most part, Part, those warnings have worked. We are expecting about a 10% drop in travel versus last year nationwide. And this is the greatest year over year drop that we've seen since the Great Recession in 2008. Still, millions of people are expected to travel for the holiday. We've never taken a road trip with all our kids, so this is our first time and probably our last. <laughs> and most are opting for the highway. 777 miles, so it's about a 10-hour trip. Over the airport. If you're traveling in your own vehicle, you know who's been in that vehicle. You know how well it's been cleaned. Cooper says drivers should still take precautions. Wear a mask everywhere. And you caught me here without my mask on. But like limiting stops and knowing COVID restrictions in the states they're driving through. Every state that we travel to is different. Some people don't like to wear the mask. Drivers stopping at the state line. I got my gloves. Had their own checklist. Every time I get in the car, I wash my hands, oh. we're sanitized. Hoping to get to their Thanksgiving destinations. <laughs> going on four days now. <laughs> as safely as possible. Then when we get back home, we're going to quarantine for two weeks. Eric Hilt. Get tested again. News Channel 5.